This is an activity to get your brains in gear, to get you working. Now, what you need to do is find some blocks, okay? They can be building blocks, they could be things like this where you can actually connect them, construction bricks. Even the little ones, the Lego ones, the bigger ones, it doesn't really matter so long as you've got a good variety of colour and they are all actually fit together. Then you just get some pieces of card. These are from a cereal box, I think, or a tissue box, something like that. And I've just divided each one. They're about two centimetres, I would think, but each one is divided into six different sections. And each section I've coloured uh, a colour that represents a brick so make sure don't put purple on there if you haven't got any purple bricks for example they need to be a range of colours mixed up that represent the bricks that you've got and the idea is that you challenge people at home uh, brothers sisters whoever's at home you challenge them to see who can complete this task the quickest and what you could do is, you could, you could predict, you could say, I predict that older people will be slower at completing this task. Or I might say, I predict that younger people will be slower at completing this task and older people will be much quicker. Okay? So the challenge is, you hand someone their card face down and you find some way of timing this. Now I've got a timer and I know this timer takes about 30 seconds or you could use your stopwatch. The stopwatch on your phone is really good for this activity. I can't actually use that because I'm talking into the, the smartphone at the moment. But the idea is you record the person if you're looking at age and how fast they can do this you record their age, make sure they're not telling you lies, and then you record how long it took them. And if you think older people will be quicker, then you need to use your evidence that you collect. So what do you need? A table as a result. And remember, it doesn't look like that. It's not a scribbled piece of paper with numbers on it. It is a column, the name of the person. If you're exploring and investigating their age, then that's their age and then it's how long it took them. So I'm going to do one just to see how good I am using my timer. So I will turn the timer over as I turn my card over and then I will try my best, it did want to time me after all, to complete this before that runs out and it's very stressful. Did I get it right? But I did it easily, easily before. That took me about 15 seconds according to this timer. So that's that one. And then I've got lots of different ones. It doesn't matter what they look like, what they're like, so long as you've got a different sequence of colours and you can use the bricks to construct the colours that are on there. Check it, record the time. Who's the quickest? Was your prediction correct?